हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू प्राइस यू एजू यूट्यूब चैनल दिस इज स्कॉलरशिप एग्जाम स्टैंडर्ड फिफ्थ ऑनलाइन क्लास सब्जेक्ट मैथमेटिक्स एंड द टॉपिक इज रीम ग्रॉस और वी कैन से द पेपर मेजरमेंट्स एंड विद दिस वन क्वाइंस एंड द करेंसी नोट्स सो दिस इज एक्सरसाइज ट्वेंटी थ्री पॉइंट टू विच इज अवेलेबल इन अवर नव न्यूट डाइजेस्ट ऑन पेज नंबर टू हंड्रेड एंड एटी सेवन सो देर इज अ क्वेश्चन नंबर वन इज देर स्वरा परचेज अ फ्रीज फॉर रुपीज फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड नाइन हंड्रेड एंड एटी एंड टी वी सेट फॉर ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड सेवन हंड्रेड एंड फोर्टी सी गेव नाइनटीन नोट्स ऑफ रुपीज टू थाउजेंड टू द शॉपकीपर हाउ मेनी रुपीज टेन नोट्स विल द शॉपकीपर रिटर्न हर सो वी विल फर्स्ट कैलकुलेट द फ्रीज एंड द टी वी सेट्स टोटल वैल्यू ओके सो टी वी सेट this is to be said so that is a total uh, purchase value so this is a 15980 plus this is a 20740 so with this one this is the total is the rupees 36720 so this is the purchase value and she gives 19 notes of rupees 2000 okay so means this is a 2 multiplied by 19 is a 38 and this 1000 okay so means 38000 she has given so from this we have to deduct the purchase value so minus 36720 so after this deduction you will get 1280 this much rupees shopkeeper will return but the condition is that the 10 rupees notes will be written okay so means divided by the 10 so zero get cancel zero get cancel means this is a 128 notes will return and this is given in option number 4 now question number 2 srikant bought a watch for rupees 900 so i will maintain here 900 okay so this is a watch cost he gave equal number of notes of denominations so it means in a grouping okay so rupees 10 okay plus rupees 20 this is a notes value means 10 20 and we are making that together value so with the 50 notes and then 100 notes okay so this is equals to the uh, we can say this is equal amount of the 180 rupees okay so this is a collective amount of all the one single single notes okay so this is 180 and He has to give the total nine hundred rupees. So means divided by this one eighty. So this zero get cancel, zero get cancel. Eighteen ones and eighteen fives are. So means there is each number having the five numbers note. Okay, means in quantity ten also five, twenty also five, fifty also five, and hundred notes also five. So these five numbers and find the number of the notes of the rupees twenty. Twenty also having the five numbers. Okay, so five means option number three is a correct one. now option number 3 is correct one now question number 3 manoj has 26 notes of rupees 2 and some 5 rupees notes so 26 having the 2 rupees notes so 2 multiply by 26 so this is a 52 rupees value of the rupees 2 and some 5 rupees notes but that quantity not given if he has rupees 127 with him then how many 5 rupees notes does he have okay so total 127 rupees here out of that one 52 rupees of the rupees 20 means 26 notes are there and remaining are the rupees 5 notes so we have to find out the total value of the 5 notes first so this is a 7 minus 2 is a 5 and 12 minus 5 is a 7 so 75 is the amount of total of the rupees 5 okay so we have to find out the total quantity of the 5 so with the 5 dividedation okay so 5 ones are and here 5 ones are and then here the 2 means 5 fives are means there are the 15 numbers of the 5 rupees notes and this is given in option number 4 now question number 4 nandita bought three mangoes for rupees 15 each and five pineapple for rupees 25 each she gave the fruit seller two notes of 100 rupee what amount will she get back so we will calculate here so 15 rupees each as per the mango rates so 
and multiply by three number of the mangoes so number of three so this is the 45 rupees of the mangoes then five pineapples so five and each pineapple having the 25 rupees so this is a 125 so togetherly we have to make this and after this one 200 two notes has given so this is the 10 and 1 by carry so 7 and 1 so 170 rupees so but c has given 2 multiply by 100 okay means 200 rupees given and the purchase value is this one so 200 minus 170 means c will get the 30 rupees back okay and this is given in option number 2 now question number 5 sushant wrote amount rupees 35 paise as 35.5 35.5 but actually 35 rupees and 5 paise was there okay so, but he he has by mistakenly written as like this one so what is the difference between these amounts so this is also amount whatever he has written but actually he has to supposed to has to write down this one so what is the difference in between this one so 50.5 means we can say Th sorry 35.5 means 35 rupees and 50 paise and now this we will convert in a decimal so 5 paise means 5 divided by 100 means this is a 0 0.05 and with the 35 means 35.05 so this is a bigger value because of the 50 is here so divide minus 35 point this amount we will deduct so this is a 45 and then decimal here and this is a zero means 0.45 this is a rupees okay means to convert in a paise multiply by with a hundred so this is a 45 paise and 45 paise is given in option number one now question number six anita purchase 10 kg of rice at 48 rupees 10 kg of rice as per the 48 rupees per kg and 3 kg of the tur dal as per the 150 rupees per kg rate she gave two notes of rupees 500 to the shopkeeper what amount will she get back so first of all purchase amount we will calculate so rice purchase amount is 48 multiplied by 10 means 480 and then 150 multiplied by 3 means 450 so total is this is 0 8 plus 5 is a 13 so 1 carry and 1 plus 4 plus 4 is a 9 so 9 30 is a total purchase amount so but c has given 500 two notes so this is a rupees thousand he has c has given so thousand minus this amount means purchase amount so balance is the 70 so c will give the c will get the rupees 70 so 70 is given in option number four now question number seven arnav has bundles of rupees 10 notes 82 then 57 and 60 okay so then to the 82 59 and 80 so from this to the this these numbers notes he has of rupees 10 then what is the total value of the bundle notes this number of the notes means 60 number also notes is there so to find out the total number of the quantity from this number we have to deduct this number but not this means 760 previous notes number means deduction with this one because this note number also we have to consider okay so that's why from this one we have to deduct 82 57 59 means last before or we can say previous number okay or we can say from this one if you divide this one at the last we have to add the one because this con this number also we have to consider that is a fundamental okay so after this deduction you will get the total 50, uh, 220 one so this much of the note quantity he has and that is a each having the rupees 10 so multiply by 10 means this is a 2210 and this is a in option number two now question number eight how many 20 rupees notes is equal to 240 coin of five rupees so 240 coins of rupees 5 so multiply by 5 each coin is a 5 rupees value so this is a equals to the 1200 rupees okay so but uh, we have to find out the how many 20 rupees notes is equals means we have to divide it with the 20 so that much of the 20 rupees quantity will take out so this zero get cancelled zero get cancelled so this is a 60 means we can say 
ट्वेंटी रुपीज सिक्सटी नोट्स हैविंग द इक्वल अमाउंट और इक्वल विथ टू हंड्रेड एंड फोर्टी ऑफ द फाइव रुपीज नोट्स ओके दैट इज द मीनिंग एंड सिक्सटी इज गिवन इन ऑप्शन नंबर थ्री ना क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन हाउ मेनी नोट्स ऑफ रुपीज टेन कैन गेट कैन वन गेट इफ वन गिवज थर्टी क्वाइंस ऑफ रुपीज फाइव सो थर्टी क्वाइंस ऑफ रुपीज फाइव मीन्स दैट इज अ वन हंड्रेड एंड फिफ्टी एंड दिस एक्सचेंज विथ रुपीज टेन बट दैट हाउ मेनी नोट्स वील गेट दैट वी हैव टू कैलकुलेट सो फॉर दिस वन दिस इज द अमाउंट to be exchanged divided by with the 10 rupees because 10 rupees each notes required so this is a 15 numbers okay and 15 numbers is given in option number 3 now question number 10 if 25 coins each of rupees 2 5 rupees and 10 are taken what will be the total amount so 25 coins of rupees 2 so 25 multiplied by 2 then plus 25 multiplied by 5 then plus 25 multiply by 10 okay so this is a 50 plus this is a 125 plus this is a 250 so this is a equals to the 425 this is the amount and this is given in option number 4 now question number 11 Dhanesh went to bank with the eight notes of rupees 50 and 100 each and asked for the notes of rupees 10 in return means exchanging how many notes of rupees 10 would dhanesh receive so first of all we have to calculate the total amount for this one so 50 and 100 rupees each eight notes okay so 8 multiply by 50 plus 100 togetherly we will take so 8 multiply by 150 so this is a equals to the 1200 and uh, exchanging with a rupees 10 so divided with a 10 so it's equals to the 120 so he will get the rupees 10s 120 notes and this is given in option number 3 thank you